Hi my loves, thanks for returning. I hope this video finds you happy and doing well. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be on a quick, super glam holiday look. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. All right, so I just wanted to pop in here really fast and do a really quick and easy glam look for the holidays. Nothing too fancy, no fuss. And I'm just gonna use a lot of my favorite products that I've been enjoying using in 2020. So with all of that being said, let's get into it all right so this is gonna be a really quick simple holiday glam look you know how it is ladies when you're going out and you know you don't have much time and you know sometimes you just don't want to do the most during the holiday so this is for that person who wants a really simple look I'm gonna start off with this Charlotte Tilbury palette this is her uh, Bejewel palette I think that's the name of it so I'm gonna start off with this shade right here start off with that red and apply that right there in my crease and remember this is a simple look okay we're gonna keep it really simple and I feel as though you can still look really glamorous without having a over-the-top eye look okay and you really don't have to spend a lot of time so as you can see I'm just blowing this red out all the way to the top okay and I'm gonna apply some more of this red on my lid okay so I'm still using one shade and I'm just gonna apply it just like that and I'm gonna continue Go back in and blow that out. So truth be told, if you wanted to, you could just kind of stop your look right here if you wanted to, okay? But since it is for the holidays, we won't. So I'm gonna do the same thing to this side and I'll be right back. All right, so now that I have all of that red blown out, and remember, I just only have one shadow up now. So next, I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna stay within this three little right here this little trio right here and now i'm going to apply that shade right there on the inner part of the eye and just apply it really softly and i'm gonna do the same thing on the other side okay and i'm going to use my finger because sometimes with these palettes you can get a little bit of a better payoff if you use your finger Okay, and then on the middle part, I'm going to use this shade right here. And I'm gonna do the same thing over here. And now with a clean brush, I'm just gonna go in and go over this inner part right here, just to kind of soften that up a little bit. All right, so now I got all that applied, I'm going to add my eyeliner and my eyelashes. And for my eyelashes, I'm going to use a SHEO by, I'm going to use my Velour Lashes. Um, I've really been enjoying Velour Lashes this year. And these are the SHEO, get it, CEO Lashes. So I'm gonna do some liner lashes and I'll be right back. All right, so I got my lashes on, got the eyes done, and I'm going to keep my lower lash line kind of simple. Um, I don't want it smoked out or anything like that. I'm just going to put some mascara on my lower lash line, so that's why that still looks uh, blank. When you're doing your look, you can have it as smoked out or as glamorous as you want. All right, so with that being said, let's go in with the foundation that I have been loving, and this is by Too Faced for, um, for this year, I have to say that this is like my favorite foundation. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this. And I don't use primers. If you're familiar with my channel, you know that I don't use primers. Um, I just go in with my normal skincare. I will go in with a setting spray once I complete this, but yeah. So anyway get this all applied all right now that I have all of that applied I'm going to go in with my YSL concealer I do like the Pat McGrath concealer as well uh, but this one I feel the color is a little bit better or goes a little bit better so I'm going to apply this and blend it all out And 
if you aren't really into doing the highlighting and all of that, this step can definitely be skipped. And for the inner part of the eye, when you are blending in your concealer, just use a brush. If your sponge isn't getting in close enough. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and blend this all out and I'll be back. All right, so I'm back and for my bronzer, I'm going to use the Fenty Cream Bronzer and this is in chocolate. And here it is right here. This is really, really pretty. Um, I find that I don't need a lot of this. So I'm just going to add this on the perimeter. Okay, and I'm gonna bring it in just like this. And I'm gonna bring it down here. And as you can see, you don't need a lot of it, just a little bit. So I'm just gonna blend this in with this little brush that I'm using now. And then I'm gonna go back in with my foundation brush and just kind of go over the top of it just a little bit. And I haven't set my under eye yet. I'm not sure if you can see it, but my eyes are starting to water. <laughs> it never fails here lately. Okay, so it looks like I got all of that just blended in really nicely. And now I'm going to, um, since my eyes are watering, I'm going to set under my eyes last. And I'm gonna go in with the outer perimeter of my face and set it with a powder. And for the powder to go all over my face, I'm gonna use my By Terry powder and this is in shade 400. And I'm just going to take a big brush like this and go all over my face. And then for bronzer, I'm gonna use this Jouer palette. This has been my favorite for 2020 to use. These shades are so pretty. And I'm gonna go in with this darkest shade right here. And because it's a glam look, I'm going to use a lot. <laughs> Do a little bit on my nose. And then I'm gonna come down and just do under my chin a little bit. And that is it, so, so beautiful. This is gorgeous, you all. So I'm thinking my under eye has kind of settled a little bit and I'm gonna set it with this Libra Prism Powder. This is it right here. And this is the one that has the four shades and then you just put it in your top, okay, and mix them together, or at least that's how I do. And then I'm just gonna set my under eye. All right, and then for my lipstick, I think I'm gonna go in with a deep burgundy shade. And this is just a lip gloss by Melt Cosmetics. All right, so got that on. And, and for highlight, I'm gonna go into this uh, Natasha Denona Diamond Blush Palette. Uh, and I think I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this cream shade right here. Start off with the cream and just kind of put it right there and on my nose. And I'm gonna go in with the older um, highlighting palette. This is by Laura Mercier. And I'm gonna use this deeper shade right here to go over what I just applied because I feel like what I just applied is a little bit too light and I don't know if this is helping either. And then to finish it all off, I'm gonna go in with my favorite setting spray for 2020. This is the Physician's Formula 24K setting spray and it's got little gold flakes in it. And I'm gonna go over it a little bit with my sponge. All right, so this is it. Let me know down in the comments what some of your favorite glam looks have been here on the YT. I'd love to hear about it. Hope you all have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.